Welcome back. <laughs> Afternoon. <laughs> so, you might wonder where we are. Well, today we've got for you... It's a little bit new. Yeah. We're on the other side of the marina and we've got a boat tour. And this one, this week, I'm really excited because it's a barge. So we're going <laughs> to show you inside. Okay, so this is the barge we are here to see. And her name is... Eureka Moment, Brigantine 3. There she is. Okay, come inside. It's a big step, isn't it? It is a big step. Not wide, like, <laughs> I don't fall off. So this is the wheelhouse. And um, we've got beautiful teak flooring. Yes. Really nice seating area, area with wraparound seating and all enclosed. Oh, all right round. So yeah. Gets all the way around the back. It's good, isn't it? Yeah. Got the steering wheel. Really good visibility, actually. Even for me, as a shorty. I could drive this. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> So we've got all our controls on here. All the usual. It's funny, this is on the left. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Wait, there's no space the other side. No. And did you say this was a remote control? Yeah. It's got bow and stern thrusters there. So you've got two. And then you've also got remote control. So you can put it around your neck and be like, <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, I like that. But then you are stood here doing it. Yeah. I suppose it's handy if you're out trying to tie lines up and you want to move the boat across, you can just press your button around your neck and Definitely. pull it in. And this um, wheelhouse is also collapsible and it's on hydraulics. Yeah. Um, so literally it's, it's one there, one all there these fold down. All, the doors are like barn doors so you can collapse them. The hydraulics take the roof down and then up here you have a little hatch so once the roof is once the roof is dropped, basically you can still <laughs> stand, stand here and there. drive with your head out the hatch. There's just one thing with that though, because I've done it. When you when this is down, obviously you can get through the low bridge, and it is electric as well. Because there's, there's your button to put the roof down. Yeah. There'll be locks on them, so you'll have to take the locks off. You, you drop it all down. You drop the roof down, but then you're stuck because you cannot get out of the boat. Oh, yeah. Because once that roof's down and all the windows are dropped, you normally can't open the door. <laughs> so you're, you're physically stuck in the I suppose it's boat. literally just to get under a bridge, isn't it? Yeah, you'd then have you people the on the outside, again. already on the outside with your ropes. You would then take it through the bridge, moor back up again, and then you'd put the roof yeah. back up. How cool, though. And you only want to do that maybe once or twice a year. You know? <laughs> it's not a thing you do every week. But there's all this detail, and even up here as well, you've got the wood, which is lovely. Let's go inside. An adventure. Yeah. We've already um, opened that hatch up. Yeah, I, I like this boat. Okay. So, down we come, down three steps. Straight into the galley. So I come tumbling down. <laughs> So, um, pretty standard galley, I guess. You've got um, three nice big drawers over this side. Huge drawer down here, so that's really good for pots and pans and stuff. Um, you have over here, that's just a big cupboard. You've got your washing machine. I'm assuming it's probably a washer dryer. Hang on, let me put all glasses on and I can tell you. Yeah, same as ours, same make. Isn't yeah, it? looks like it. Wine storage. Wine storage up here. Or you get your rockets in there. <laughs> then we've got a um, shoreline fridge and freezer. Yeah. Freezer there. Mm. It's got a bit of swellage probably on the wood that happens on all boats. Um, you've got your oven here. Yeah, let me get around here. That oven's hardly been used. Yeah, it, uh, it, looks, in there, it like, looks brand new, doesn't it? It literally looks brand new. It's only got 450 hours, hasn't it? Yeah, it has. And yeah, it's a 2016? 20, 
15, I think it's. I think it's made 15, we'll check launched that in a minute. 16. 16. Yeah, you could be right. You've got and then it came up the Thames head. up to here. Yeah, and, and it's, it's been, been based here ever, here ever since. Um, four ring hob. This is a really nice hob, actually. Gas as well. hob. Gas hob. You've got loads of like storage mm. cupboards. Little one in the corner here. Big cupboard. It's got deep, in it? Yeah, there's lots. Electrical points down there. Yeah, lots of Toast plug them. sockets, which is really good. Look, more plug sockets over here. There's quite a lot in the kitchen, actually. Big cupboard here. What's in that one? I don't know if this, does this slide? Oh, it lifts. It's just a. Oh, look at that. It's not bolted down. No. It's just literally. No, it, oh, no, it's not. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? Trainer. You can put it over the sink. Yeah, I think you can. Hmm. What's in that one? Does that one go right this back one? or is that just a side? Oh, yeah, no. no, that goes right back into oh, the... Heat. You'll get in there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I won't. And then... Electrical cupboard. Electrical cupboard here. So there it's you got go. water tank, waste tank, fuel, two fuel tanks, heating and propulsion. Yeah, you've got twin tanks. So you've got a heating tank and an engine tank and that's your distribution block. It's oh, 24 yeah. volts, this boat. Yeah. Yeah, it's got a 24 volt supply. This will be all your That's your electrical, electrical panel. panel. More bits your Victron there. Huge unit. Victron. Eight kilowatts. Massive. Yeah. Oh, you can run some stuff off that. Good. <laughs> so that's your galley, and then basically you're into the lounge area. Oh, that's it's got really nice floors. The as well. saloon, yeah. It's, um, the floors are lovely. I want to say that's actual wood floor as well. I think everything is wood in here. It is actually, isn't it? You'd, we missed that bit, but look. Oh yeah. Underfloor heating. And then you've got battery monitor down there. Climate and then you've got control. Climate control. So you've even got, got air, air conditioning, conditioning in here. Amazing. Yeah. It's, I think it's in every room. Yeah, I think you're well, right. Not hundred percent, but I think it is. Um. I believe this boat comes with like the furniture and the cutlery and stuff like that as well. Whatever's in it. Yeah, whatever's in, in it. it. Um, yeah. It's a nice sofa actually. Yeah, nice big sofa. Um, these cupboards, all the cupboards have got these um, push buttons on. And look at these, these have been made so they can be opened around the sofa, which is really cool. Like they lock shut, don't they? They lock shut, yeah, all of the... All the cupboards um, have the little locks on them, There's which is great. There's six plug sockets in that wall. Yeah. That's You'll something never that... be short of plug no, sockets, No, no. And you'd be amazed how many plug sockets. There's look, another one here as well. No. So you could sit and charge your phone if you needed to. Excellent. So cool. And then you've got your TV over here. TV down there, Gunners. That big box there, that's... That's air conditioning. You see it sticking out. We didn't notice it to start with, but it actually behind there is an air conditioning unit. Yep. So it needs to be there. But it's you don't notice it, do you? No, no. Um, I think it's got undergun all lights as well. Yeah. So there's all lights along there, but we never found them. And you've got um, a dog box. Um, and you've got a blind cross there. Yeah. And each side winds up for that. So you can yeah. open one side if it's windy. Okay, we've got a diesel stove here as well. Yeah, little diesel fireplace. So little diesel, diesel fireplace. Nice and easy at light, and you yeah. don't have to worry about logs. Mind you, I do like logs. But then you do get the flame from that. So then we'll go down this way. What I like about these It's is quite the wide, hallway. isn't it? It's it is really quite wide. wide. We've it's like a standard door, almost. Um, there's literally um, porthole bungs for every single porthole. We've taken them out just to give the video a bit more light. Because if you see this, this boat is for sale. If you see this on the website, it doesn't do it justice. The pictures really don't do it justice. They look, it looks quite dark. It's really not dark at all. I thought it was dark wood. Yeah, no, it's really it lovely. Old sauna. Yeah, no, it's, it's really what, pretty. It's, it's nice, yeah. It's a nice wide hallway. And then into the second bedroom. So, um, it's a double bed. A decent sized bed. You've got little drawers, you've got cupboards all the way above here. Again, more than enough um, plug sockets. We've got a wardrobe this side, big wardrobe that side, and then I'm sat here because it's easier, you can't, it's a bit difficult oh, to see around see the door. Yeah. But we've got, we've got another two cupboards this side. Yeah, two cupboards this side. You've got a TV at the end of the bed, and what this 
uh, boat has. Every single door is on, um, you can latches. hear that, it's got a latch, so the doors can't um, rock around. about. Yeah, it's yeah. brilliant. And there's loads of storage under this bed, or lots of space for is, storage is, under the bed. You won't really see, but it's totally empty. I mean, we could store our bikes under there. You yeah. can even get the inflatable under there and all the pedal boards. And as you know, like <clears throat> um, storage on a boat is literally premium, isn't it? That's what you go for, so. Yeah, really nice second bedroom. I'll swap you. I'm in here now. Oh, TV, and you can see the wardrobe there. There's loads, isn't there? Yeah. But there's these wardrobes here down the side are quite small because you've lost all that space there. Yeah, but because but you then have you come got outside, squeezing around here, a nice and you've got like a utility big cupboard. Utility cupboard, brilliant. Again with plugs. Plug socket. So if you've got a rechargeable vacuum, then you can plug that in. You Amazing. Can put your coats on there. Can yeah. You? Yeah. Just literally. out of the way there, yeah. so you've got like a hallway cupboard. Yeah. You've got obviously your monitors, your CO2 monitors, etc. You can see I've taken the porthole bungs out, so we've got some nice light in here because you've got the nice um, light tops here. Bathroom's really lovely. Beautiful double floor. As well. Yeah, double glazed. Underfloor yeah. heating, imagine in the bathroom. Yeah, got, well, everywhere, I think. Yeah. <clears throat> You've even got a B day. Yes, a B day in your bathroom. <laughs> nice big shower, lots of storage again. Cupboard down the bottom there. Again, look, they've even thought about it so you can open it. Ah, so it doesn't hit the loo. Yes, yeah, so it doesn't hit the B day. B day, very posh. Macerator toilet. It's not sink. Nice sink, yeah, big cupboards, lots of cupboards. I like the floor. Floor's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. It's really nice, yeah, lovely sink. Huge mirror. I mean, we've got two sinks in our room, in our boat. Do we, we need two sinks? One. We only ever use one, don't we? Don't need yeah. two sinks, really. I had to put the tap on the other day just to flush the water. <laughs> just to make sure the water that it was stuck in that bit of pipe didn't go mouldy. Yeah. And it did smell. Do you know what? Again, look, that's even got... The towel rail the, Yeah, it. and there's a massive towel rail. I don't know if you want to come in, Richard. I'll swap you. Yeah. Like, shut the door. There you go. Massive towel rail. Yeah, huge. Yeah. It's a good shower as well. What size? Oh, it's, yeah, it's, it's well big enough, yeah. Easy. Overhead. Yep. <laughs> I like it, it's nice, isn't it? It is nice. And you can sit on the loon, you can see yourself in the mirror. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> and now we're going into the main bedroom. Back to you. <coughs> yeah, these doors are huge, aren't they? They're all standard yeah. doors, aren't they? Yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, they're... Because ours slope off, don't they? No, do, yeah. Whereas these are, yeah, squared Indeed. off. So, up here... You can open, it's like a double hatch, so you can open the double hatch to look out onto the bow of the yeah, boat, which is quite right cute. Out. Yeah. Um, Put some light in. Isn't it? So again, nice big, don't know, I don't know if this is a, a double or if it's bigger than a double, but it's a big bed anyway. Um, <laughs> your portholes. Um, you've got... Half frosted, are they? Or? Uh, oh, no, no, I think it's just where it's cold. You've got... Um, Half, I call it half storage under the bed, as in you've got two big drawers either side, but you have got your tank, haven't you, That's underneath the bed? Yeah. Tank, I think. But there's so much storage on this boat. It's massive. It's the same size, 60 foot by 12 foot 6. Yeah, same as ours, yeah. But I don't get where they get all this space from. So you've got the little railings on here, so things yeah, don't fall off. It gets a bit rough on the river. Yeah. You don't spill your, spill your champagne. What's that for? I didn't notice Is that. Is that before. a vent? Oh, maybe. I don't know. That's probably a, for the air conditioning. Ah. Uh -huh. Again, some... It is. Lots of, see, there's even, like, a um, double plug socket in the cupboard. That's it's good. It's brilliant, it's isn't it? Charge the radios on. Yeah. Stuff, it? Nice big... You know, they're big wardrobes. Now, see, I'd put the telly in there. Because <laughs> the telly is actually over there behind the door. Yeah. If I shut the door, if you're sat on the bed, you're watching the telly like that. Uh, that you'll probably find that moves. Oh, that probably actually. pulls out. I don't want to pull I'm it. I'm not going to pull it. No, you're just, not going to touch it. No, I'm just going to have a look. Yeah, it is. It's on a swing arm, so you can pull that out. Uh, yeah. 
You just make sure no one can I just won't pull it, just because it'll be my luck that something happens. Nice, um, you've wall. got six big drawers here as well. That bottom one's bigger than it, I've seen that. I think it is actually, yeah. That's, yeah, it is. It's a so nice it? deep drawers. And then here... That's another bit of the air conditioning. Air conditioning. Unit. I think it's got two of these big units throughout the boat. And yeah. This one's in the bedrooms. I think so there's one, one in the bedroom, the bedroom, one in the lounge, I think. Yeah. And that's probably the vent out, isn't it, at the top there? Probably. So fingers go through it. Yeah, it is. Yeah. yeah. So that's a vent. So yeah. That will be sucking the air in and then it will be blowing it out. So it's all air conditioned. It's and you've got, you know. It's awesome. Oh yeah, then these are like waterproof porthole bungs for every single porthole. They're good because then you don't have to clean your windows off. Yeah. I'm really, really impressed with this boat. It's, it's a nice boat. Really is a nice boat. Back down the hallway. Like that bathroom. Do you like that bathroom? All right, Shrek. <laughs> That's a nice boulder. <laughs> <laughs> I like these lights under it and they're all lit up. Yeah. There's so much space down here. There is, lots of space, yeah. It's crazy. So we've just come outside just to show you um, also that it has satellite. Yeah, it's got satellite TV. Yeah. Are you coming out the front? Uh, we could go up the front. And I'll show you the bits up the front. Okay. It's got... 3GN, I think. Yeah, that's it. Wi Fi aerials. Oh, oh, I feel quite confident walking along here, and I've got a camera in my hand, so yeah. yeah. Okay. So, your water tank there. Hold on a minute. I'm just going to zoom out because I zoomed in. Right, water tank. We've got water tank there. Yep. And then your pump out is there. Yep. Because that water tank is under your bed in the main bedroom. Yeah. And this was your little shutter doors for your bedroom window. Ooh. So you got these Isn't open it? from the inside. So that's I the mean, bedroom window. Yeah. It's the yeah. only thing on the, this boat could do with probably a bit of a polish. There's a couple of touch-up areas, and the varnish needs a bit of attention. But do you know what? It's the a woodwork just needs yeah. to wipe off. It's a, a rub down and a quick. It's a stunning boat for the money. Yeah. And no real rust on it. Paint no, works. no, it's paintwork's really good. good paint it's really work. good, yeah. You've got three three lockers up here. Yep. Uh, not really lockers. This one down there. Wow. I mean, that's a long way down there. That's just your bow thruster. So that's oh, your, that is a long that's way. That's your bow thruster control. You think when we're in ours... Oh, God. <laughs> I nearly fell over. <laughs> you know, in ours, I can reach the bow thruster. And I, we did it in a video. Yeah. We? we can undo it. I can't even get to it. You no. have to climb down. Into there. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I could get in there. But yeah. I'm so that, that's that one. This one is your gas bottles. So you've got two gas bottles in there. Yep. With a regulator valve and a shut off there. There's also another shut off inside the boat. Right. For those. And then this one is your batteries. So you've got batteries for your bow thruster. Ah. And it also seconds as a oh, chain it's got locker. Oh, your chain locker for your yeah. anchor. I mean, what I would say is if I bought this boat, I would redo these wires. Yeah. Because they're a little bit close to the chain. But that's just the design. And you have actually got anchor. Yeah, proper anchor. So you've got a full-on anchor down there. I'll hang over the side, shall I? No, don't hang over the side. We don't want you to stack it. It's hefty. Yeah? He yeah, that's all I could say. Hefty I'll, anchor. Probably about 50 kilos, actually. Oh. I'm going to just got a little mast. Yep. So you've got your lights, your navigation lights, and this one. That's a cheeky CCTV. Oh. And the monitor you saw on the top there, I don't know if you pointed it out. Right, right. Richard's now coming in just to do uh, the oh. engine. <laughs> easy engine boy, so. Uh, I think you're going to say something else. These are on, I like these. Ta -da! It does it itself. Yeah, on the uh, hydraulic yeah. struts. Yeah. Whoa, look at that. Nice. Cool. Barris Shire is 90, isn't it? I, yes, it is, yeah. 90 horsepower. Yeah. Um, Oh, they've missed so much stuff off this boat. There is so much stuff in it. So there's your stern thruster. Oh, hold you on. You can reach that one. 
So stern thruster. Yeah, that one there. Yeah. Um, there's all, all you can't see it so much, but all your stern thruster controls are under there. Mm -hmm. Because again, they are on remotes. Um, is that a ninety Barris Shire, isn't it? Yeah. A lovely engine. But what they haven't told you is, I believe that also has a travel pack on it. What does that mean? Um, once you get out on the river and yeah. you take the revs up, it's like an alternator. Right. But it's a massive alternator. Charges your batteries up so fast. Because ah. um, the normal, you've got two alternators anyway, we'll point them out, shall we? But that, that's probably your engine alternator. Mm -hmm. So that'll charge your engine battery for your starting. Yeah. You've got another one here. Mm -hmm. um, that'll be for your battery bank as well. But if you look down there, I don't know if you can see. No, I don't see, think I can. Or if I'll take it. Do you want me to take it? As he pushes down there, you've got that huge green unit. That is a travel pack alternator. Cool. And it's probably four times the size of that one there. Wow. <laughs> so, basically, it's got. It's also got, I believe, a generator. Uh, I think I read it did have a generator, I it, want to it say. It has a hospital silencer. Cool. So that exhaust, means it's quiet. The exhaust is quiet. Yeah, and it's got so much gear under here. You've got another air conditioning unit under there. Wow. Oh, and also we noticed that um, under the seat there, um, you've got little vents. So we think that's probably for heating out here as well. Yeah. 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 It's like little car vents. Yeah. Like. Yeah. Cool. So, hopefully you liked that. We love doing boat tours because um, I think it's just really nice, especially if you haven't bought a boat yet, to get a feel of what different boats there are out there. The only thing yeah. is, it then fills us with boat envy because then we see like some of the gear on some of these boats and go, oh no, Dude, under we there want this is, one now. <laughs> yeah, there, it's isn't got it? really good setup. It's got such a high spec. It has, yeah. So this one is for sale again at Shepperton Marina, so uh, Boat Show Rooms of London, one nine 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 fifty. Get a lot of boat for your money. This um, this is a nice board. boat. It is a lot of kit. Yeah. So if you go online and you see the um, pictures, just don't do um, the boat justice at all. She is a stunning boat. So, yeah, I think uh, if you like it, you need to come and see it. Yeah, definitely. Don't go off. Yeah, yeah don't go off the it. pictures. Yeah, come and see this it. It's so. a nice place to be. I think. And we're not getting paid for this. We're just nosy. <laughs> Um, so it's like, oh, you keep taking me to all these boats, aren't you? I know, and then we're like, oh man, we want this one. <laughs> yeah, and there's a Piper two boats down there. Yeah, there and is. I'm like, Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> <No>. Anyway, <laughs> hopefully you've enjoyed this uh, boat tour today, and uh, if you did, <laughs> give us a little like, and we'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Bye. Bye.